believe we're live and we are going to try this out tonight this will be my first time actually streaming this so we'll see how it works out right now we're just uh trying to finish up qualifying i am in a league race uh, multi-league race um, we got 30 minutes gte cars fixed setups baseline um got uh got quite a good set of drivers here tonight so it ought to be interesting right now i've locked onto the pole but there's three minutes left in qualifying football so we'll see how these guys do see if i get knocked off which is fine i like the challenge so right now it looks like john waters is doing quite well and crescent always does well um i think he's got some more time in the bank if he can pull it out here in another couple minutes And Bob, Bobby Rafferty showed up tonight, which I haven't seen him in a while, so it's kind of nice to see. He's usually pretty fast. So we'll see. We'll see if I get wrecked. I'm in the Corvette, so um, uh, it's a bit of a handful, especially on cold tires, so we'll see. Um, it seems to be the fastest car right now, but uh, it's also difficult to drive, so I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, anybody checks out the stream, um, uh, there's probably no one watching right now, but uh, let me know in the comments how the stream looked, um, ways to improve. Probably do this more often, uh, also do some broadcasting, uh, start doing some more broadcasting for the league, I'm set up to do that, so we'll see how that all works out. We got a broadcast race coming up tomorrow night, uh, MROC series that uh, one of our uh, iRacing partners, or league partners, Scott Patton, is set up. Uh, top 16 drivers out of the Cup Series this year, all competing in the new Gen 6 car, fixed setups, um, no tires, short sprints. It'll be broadcasted on Thursday nights for the next five weeks, and you can check that out on Multi-League TV. The channel might change, but uh, you can always go to the Multi-League website or whatever and check it out. So we got about three minutes left to qualifying, and then we'll get the show on the way. I am also the league administrator for this series, so I'll go over the rules really quick before we get started. Um, we run with 40% fuel, like I said, baseline setup. Uh, that means there is going to be a fuel stop, but it's usually two or three gallons or so, just to make things interesting. Yeah, we're still closing up qualifying here. About another two minutes left. I usually won't interrupt anybody that's trying to get their last lap in. I don't know who's still left on the track. Take a look. Got Crescent. He's trying to get the qual in. Get that pull. Daniel. Bobby Rafferty, who I haven't seen in a while. It's going to be interesting. He's usually pretty fast. See if he gets a lap in here. Looks like he's got Crescent right behind him, perhaps. He does. He's got 147 in. He got the lap in. Just 
Daniel Ferguson. Uh, might be the last car on. He might get a time in here and see what he gets. That doesn't look like he improved. Let's see. I think Niels here, Niles is uh, just getting some practice in. I believe everybody's done here. Let the clock run out. Yeah, he's done. All right, guys, I believe that's everybody now that's qualified. Hey, thanks again, everybody showing up. Bobby Rafferty, nice to see you again there, buddy. Um, Good luck to everyone tonight. Just go over the rules really quick. Um, pretty simple. Every, most people know what they are by now. Um, leader controls the starts, restarts. We don't clear black flags. 17 incident points will get you DQ'd. There's one fast repair if you need it. Um, remember, if you have an off track, to use your um, F3 relative um, before you rejoin the action. Um, pit lane. Obviously, the people coming off pit lane during the race and entering the track have just as much right to race as the people on the on the straight stretch. So just keep that in mind and, and give each other some room if that happens uh, during pit stops. Other than that, have fun. Thanks again. And tomorrow night, um, I think I'll let Kim go over what's going on tomorrow night. Uh, tomorrow night, there's um, the new gen cup cars at 8 o'clock. 8.30 uh, is the MROC series that Scott's going, and that's for the 16 guys that qualified for that. So if you didn't qualify, you can't get in. And anyway, if you do, they'll boot you out. So I'll jump in the 8 o'clock race unless you've got a paint from Scott already. Or the 8.30 race, I'm sorry. The well, we'll see how this goes. Got the pole, able to hold on to it. But, man, this Corvette's a mess, so I got a first lap. It's going to be sketchy. I can't race it too hard. Yeah, I don't know if I drink enough beer yet. Pretty nervous with this car being up front too. Now Crescent and John are both pretty fast. Just need to be smart. It's been a while since I raced here, so I don't even know when the flag comes out. Took a wild guess. Whew. Really worried about getting black flagged there. Cold tires. Remember these cold tires. This is drifting out wide. Come on. Crescent got by John. She didn't want to stop there. Her tires aren't warmed up yet. All right, here we go. 
Gonna break a little early for this first corner because seems like uh, on the first lap here these tires just don't want to grip up yet. But it should be more stable after that. Yeah, I was overshooting this on the first lap when they're in practice. That worked out. We'll be able to start getting on this next lap. I hope. Or I'll put it in the fence. And that'll make everybody happy. Come on, tires, come in. Let's go. A little too much curb. Upset the car a little bit. All right, now the tires are warmed up. It's now not to get them too hot. So then I get the same behavior. Yeah, now this thing's starting to stretch out. That was a good car once you, uh, if you treat it well, I guess. See if I can stretch this out. Maybe not. Uh, he's hanging in there. Uh, draft. God, I hate this chicane in this car. Actually, I just hate chicanes. All right, again, another two tenths since last lap. I think if I can break the draft on him, I can probably start out running him, but easier said than done. He's a good driver, so. Yeah, Todd, Todd is back in fourth place. That's always good to see. Yeah, it's looking like about two gallons I'm going to need, but I'll probably put in three if be safe. Especially if I can get any distance on Crescent here. It's 
spend more time in the pits. Make sure I got enough fuel. Yeah, it's freaking chicane. I didn't get any time that time. That's right. We'll just sit back and relax. Try to keep our tires somewhat from getting too hot here. As Larry McReynolds would say, I keep some goodie left on the tire. Doesn't do any good to be fast if you can't manage your equipment. God, if I could just break this draft. And I need to focus on what I'm doing. I just blew that first corner there. a little time on me but I slowed it up a little bit see if I can manage myself a little bit better here the chicane is giving me some fits right now for some reason must be giving everybody fits though because it didn't really gain on me in the chicane Oh no, we lost Ant. Gonna be our Monday night truck administrator. Since we lost a uh, good friend, Kent Conley. Thinking about you, buddy. Also, something else. I'm not used to talking and uh, driving. Maybe if I just shut up, I could go faster. Yeah, 
looks like Crescent's starting to push a little bit, so. I really need to pick up some cleanness here. Hit my marks. guys are holding this wrong, all of them, at least the top four. Getting a little free again. Yeah, I'm not shaking him, so I'm just going to have to deal with it. How much time we got? Right here, come on. Yeah, we're halfway. Yeah, we'll have to pit in about six laps. Two gallons, but I'm going to take three, it looks like. It looks like I only need two. Third and fourth have dropped back quite a bit now. Start getting a look at your entrance to the road. 
I would, but I'm busy there, spotter. Rear end is getting dicey on this thing again. Well, if I don't shake Crescent here, I'm going to have to take bare minimum on fuel. And I almost blew it there. Ten minutes left. I'm missing shifts like crazy now. What the hell is going on? Yeah, I tried to relax too much. Yeah, right, get back into focus here. Oh, I'm getting a little bit of stutter. That's what the problem is. It's unfortunate. Not what I needed right now. I don't fix this stutter problem. Might be my last stream.
duck off, get him off me for now. Unless he follows me. Let's see if we can do a pit stop now. Get this over with. Hopefully this extra gallon doesn't kill me. Better be safe than sorry. Yelling out. Yeah, we'll just keep it there. Right, let's try to get this done without screwing it up. Not yeah, good. I don't have any traffic. It's always a risk. Yeah, we took him. Good deal. I just got to keep from effing up here. Got him out of my draft, too. Hopefully I took enough fuel. <laughs> no idea now. Could have took that full gallon and been okay. Four second lead almost. Yeah, four and a half laps. Four minutes left. Oh, definitely enough. Well, I didn't need hardly any fuel. Let's not throw this away then. The car's getting really loose in this corner here. Oh shit. It's just becoming shit right now. Making up a little bit of time, so I need to keep the pace up, but not screw it up. Bobby Rafferty up to fourth. Nice job. I haven't seen him in a couple years. Raced him a bunch in the Oval Series. Very fast. Little aggressive, but 
takes all types, I guess. All right. Crescent's gaining on me, so let's not screw this up. I have to do something with the stuttering though. White flag, one more lap. I think it might be replay spooling that I got enabled. I might disable that because it was good at the start, but I think once a get further into the race and it starts using that hard drive to save the replay I uh, start running into the stuttering I think that's what it is left crescent left what you gotta do is be smooth he's not gonna make up three seconds Even if I drive like a little old man at this point, uh, man. Car is trying to throw me out of it. Yeah, there we go. Not bad for a first stream. First win, first stream. Fix this stuttering problem. Good work, everybody. Good work. Thank you, John. Good run yourself. Good job there, Crescent. Todd, Scott, great fight. Buddy, Pierce. I know you're not John. on the road yet, man, but I just want to say you did a fantastic job today. You nice really job there, uh, Bobby. Good race there, Bobby. Todd, that was fun. I seen you coming back there, Crescent. I was out. My tires were shot. This car was getting very hard to control. Well, I gotta grab a picture and then uh, get this posted to the league site here. No, that's about perfect. I don't even have to mess with this tonight. There we go. Good job, everyone. Good way, Ken. Good race, guys. And that is it for the stream tonight. Hope you enjoy it.
that was uh, fun. You did a good job yourself. Top five. It's always a bonus. I was experiencing some big time stutter. You guys were, did you, anybody else have any stutter? Yeah, I'm gonna have to. I wonder if it's a truck, because I'm kind of concerned I did. Uh, I recorded the race uh, because I set up a streaming thing, and so I, I, I don't think that, I think what I have is replaceable. It's not it. Because uh, once you get over your RAM limit, it starts going to hard mode. I think that might be the problem. Yeah, and I think that's what I'm 